Hey class, Miss Hogan and I have been talking to y'all about the wonderful world of fractions and how a fraction is actually a fraction of a whole. And the whole can be anything. It can be a wall, it can be a bunch of blocks. But for today, the whole is this habanero pepper. Using this habanero as a whole, I will cut it up into 10 pieces. So now 10 pieces of the habanero make it my whole. So the fraction representing the whole habanero looks like this. 10 over 10 equals one whole, or 10 tenths equals one whole. And now I'm gonna put my body and my taste buds on the line to help you guys learn fractions. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna eat as many pieces of this habanero as I can before I have to drink any milk. When I'm done, we will count how many pieces of habanero I've eaten and how many is left. And then we will make a fraction out of those numbers. And so now, without further ado, I say goodbye to my taste buds. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's hot. I gotta do this, it's for math, it's for math. I have to do this. Oh, it's actually burning my eyes. Oh. Oh. Mm. Hope you guys are getting this. Oh my gosh. That's probably the hottest thing I ever eaten. I get just, it's like burning all, it's like burning all the way through. Oh. All right, I'm done. Oh, that's hot. Oh. Okay, cool. Now, if you're going to do this, make sure to wear gloves. You don't want to get that on your hands and and get it in your eyes, but it's it's a lot hotter than what I thought it was. As a matter of fact, my eyes are watering. Well, let's see how many we've got left. As you can see, I was able to eat four pieces of the habanero before I had to take a drink of milk. So there are one, two, three, four, five, six pieces left. So now, let's make a fraction out of both those numbers. A fraction that represents the number that I was able to eat, and then a fraction that represents the number that is left. And after we do that, we'll convert those to decimals mm. and percents. Mm.